Hello everyone, Melissa here, and William, and Emma. Um, welcome back to Let's Talk with Melissa and Paul. We are, we have Emma, who is, um, mm, Mother Hen. She's going to be seven, and she is the mother to, um, Bella. She's still... She's a very, very mothering dog. <clears throat> she still takes care of her baby, does things for her. So we wanted to give Emma time with William to see how she would do. Um, we haven't had any issues, you know, with the other dogs yet. Um, I took a video of Peanut, um, my smallest chihuahua, and he... <clears throat> Did not hurt William, but he did, um, like, growl at him and, like, lunge at him. He did not hurt him. Um, Peanut doesn't have grown-up teeth. Peanut never got grown-up teeth. So Peanut has very, very teeny tiny teeth, and his bark is worse than anything. He's very loud, but he's not, he doesn't have the capacity to hurt anyone. Um, we'll be showing you that video. And then we took a video yesterday of Ivy in here. And, uh, I think William might have been nibbling at her tail because she swiped at him twice. She did not hurt him. William was not hurt. Like I said, we're taking it very slow so the animals can get used to him. And as you can see, Emma is very curious about William. She's not hurting him. She's not being aggressive towards him. Um, she's wanted to be near him because, like I said, she's very mothering. Is that a... Toilet paper roll? Yep. Yeah. Those can be, those are safe. It, what happens when he tries to eat it? It's, that's what his litter's made of, is paper won't hurt him. As you can see, young William is already starting to do some zoomies. What do you think, Emma? What do you think of little William? Hi, William. Hi, sweetheart. Then he stopped. Finn's the one that we're definitely going to have to wait longer for Finn. Keep in mind, like I said, he's the Pomeranian. He's a puppy, very hyper, so we're going to take it very slow with him. So he hasn't been introduced yet. Oh my gosh, see how high he's jumping? Oh my gosh. Young William, you're so happy. <laughs> he has been peeing in the litter box. I pick up the little poopies and put them in there. He loves those crunchy things. The green thing he's eating right now loves them. <laughs> he's zooming. He's doing zoomies. Yeah, you can toss that, William, and you wouldn't get hurt. Hi, baby. Hi. Finn. I did trim some of William's nails because he's got very sharp nails. I've got some scratches, but that's okay.
He gets very excited when he's in here and then when it's time to put him to bed, he doesn't want to get out of here. Hi, William. Donovan, you've been, you're doing very good with William. Yeah, I knew you would because you're a mother. You're a good mommy. I had to chase the cat out of here last night. She jumped in here. She was messing. Oh, did, he just flopped over. She was messing with his litter pan. I had to chase. She would not listen to me. I had to chase her away and lock her in the kitchen. It's like, that is not your playpen. She's like, Daddy, what you got? I don't think we should eat a treat in here, Emma. I don't want, you know, anything, anyone to turn crazy if. Hi, Mama. Yeah, he's been keeping this clean. Like I said, he's been peeing in the litter pan. There are some little poopies right now because I do go and clean them up and dump them in there. Obviously, we've got some litter and hay on the blanket, but that doesn't matter. Clean, some clean blankies over there. Thank you, Emma. Thank you. Get over. Hi, William. Your stick bundle. Your stick bundle. That's a very good sign that he's happy when he flops over like that. <laughs> you zooming? Are you zooming, William? Emma, don't eat that. All right, Emma's not going to hurt it. All right, now this is Emma's daughter, Bella. She's the one that I said, um, she's the follower. So, um, like if Finn gets too rough with the cat, she joins in. So, this is the one that um, we will... Keep an eye on, like I said, we're keeping an eye on all of them. We just know what their personalities are and what they, what they are pop, you know, what they might do. So she's been very curious about William. He's not a mean chihuahua. This is Peanut's daughter and Emma's daughter. Those are her parents, Peanut and Emma. Hi, Bella. Hi, Bella. Hi, Bella. Hi, William. Hi, Auntie. Here. 
got your crunchy stick, William? You love those crunchy sticks. You hear little Peanut, he's getting after um, Finn. Finn's getting too rough with him. And Peanut doesn't like it. Like I said, Peanut is our smallest Chihuahua. He weighs four pounds and some ounces. He never has gotten grown up teeth. We've got the vets are stumped. So, I mean, I've had ferrets. We've had 12 ferrets before. And they've had bigger teeth than little peanuts. I mean, they're so freaking small, it's not even funny. So he's not capable of hurting anyone. He's loud, don't get me wrong. He puts out like he's a big meanie, but he physically can't hurt anyone. Look, William, you like my gnome socks? Aren't they cute? William. There you go. Getting some zoomies in. She loves that tunnel. <laughs> Very playful. Oh, oh my god. Gosh, how freaking cute. William, you're so happy. So, Bella, nothing out of Bella. William, don't eat the blanket, William. William, look, you want your sticky? He likes these bundles of sticks. Daddy and Paul did a good job picking things out for him. Yeah, hold him. I can't trust him. Here. You can look. I'm holding Finn. Oh, look at it. I just went up. Mm -mm -mm. All right, come on. Mr. Hyperactive. That's the broken tunnel. So we just kind of put that in there. He he can't get under it. He doesn't understand why he can't get under that one. But we put that in there still so he could like stand on it. See, a lot of times Emma just looks at him and starts crying because she wants, like I said, she's the mother. You're the mothering type, aren't you, Emma? loves this um, rabbit. I mean this, not rabbit, Jesus kids. This carrot, this is very heavy though. He's tried to like pick it up and toss it, but that would hurt him if he ever tossed that and hit him in the head. It is very heavy toy. Oh yeah, look at your carrot. Yeah, he's having fun tearing this ball apart. Your 
hear it. Hi, William. Look, here's your chicken to your chicken and waffle thing. I don't know, he doesn't seem very interested in this yet. It's made out of loofah, but it looks like he's chewed a little bit on it. Is your chicken and waffle? Yeah. This will be the, after his play session tonight, these two blankets will come up and we'll put the next blanket down. <gasps> William, look. William, there is a pop, or a Timothy pop. When he comes back out, I'll see if he wants it. I was sitting like this corner over here. <clears throat> Let him come up to me if he wants. William. This is really cute. Looks like it has bits of carrot. William, look at this cute Timothy pop. You could hang this. It's got a hole. He's cleaning himself. Hi, Bella. Hi, Bella. You want to suck in, Bella? Eat that, baby girl. That's for that's for William. William. Okay, I'm giving myself a bath. Okay, it's time for a bath break. Look how cute that is. Making yourself so pretty. Look. Look, William. Look. The popsicle. Why am I trying to call it a popsicle? Look. Look, baby. Look, William. Wanna see this? It's your new toy. Chewing these. All right. Oh, look, he's got his new toy. Nibbled. Yeah, I just nibbled. It didn't hurt.
it's okay. It's just sand, uh, sand looks like they're coming off. It's all right. It's all right. Our dogs are very loud when it comes to hearing noises or people coming home or So many things to experience in here. All kinds of stuff. He's been chewing on this. He likes that. There's really nothing I've found so far that he doesn't like. Finny, stop that. That's why we haven't introduced Finn yet. He's so hyper. Chewing on your ball? You like that real heavy ball. See, there's three. Here's the medium rope kind of ball. And then here's the smallest and looks just like this one, except this one has some kind of fibers in it. You like your bundle of sticks? Yeah. Finny talking. <laughs> that was a big jump, William. Finny, stop. Go lay down. Oh my gosh, William. Those are very high jumps. Very high jumps, William. Benny, get down. <laughs> he loves all of his toys. Really enjoys those really crunchy tubes that he's chomping on right there. They're real easy to break in half. I break them in half.
Do you want some more zoomies? Big jumps, William. Oh, look at him flopping over. You're so cute, William. You're so cute. Oh my goodness, that's a big jump. That's a very big jump, William. Finny, go lay down. <laughs> you flopping over, William? You just flopping? Just pushing the blanket down. Oh my goodness, that's a good jump. <laughs> Yay, William, you're so cute. Oh, look at him. Oh, you pulling your blankie? Don't eat it. Well, you don't eat it. Don't eat your blankie. I'll move that. We have that piece for him to stand on in that corner to keep him from digging up the blanket. I'll have to, when this video's over, I'll fix the blanket and I'll put it back up in that corner. Like I said, Miss Ivy, our cat, kept jumping in here last night and messing with 
William's stuff and I had to keep getting after her. She wouldn't leave it alone. Hi, William. You don't want to eat on my pants. You don't want to eat my pants, William. Look at him go. Oh, flopping over. Doing zoomies. thing I'm still trying to research is what's a good um, floor base for this type of system we have a wooden floor and um, you know that's why we've been putting the blankets and stuff down um, we've tried like a plastic mat you know like you use under a high chair and he kept wanting to chew on that so obviously that's not a good choice um, I don't know what else, um, I've seen some people had some kind of interlocking puzzle, almost look like puzzle pieces of plastic mat, but then do you have to worry about, you know, your bunny trying to eat it? So anyone who has a rabbit that knows, you know, what would be good, um, put you know underneath this please let me know that Sherpa blanket over there is gonna be the blanket that we use tomorrow it's really large but I did like how these two the flat sheet and then the flat blanket worked because you know those little smaller blankets there you have to use quite a few William. William. Young William. Got another toy over there. You found your toy? Yeah, you're going to mess with it. That's that oxbow shake, rattle, and roll toy. I know, honey, that one, oh, sweetie, that one's too low for you to go under. He doesn't, like, what's happening here? William is um, seven weeks old now. He was seven weeks old on Tuesday. So, William. I can't believe with all these toys you're still wanting to investigate the, the walls and stuff. Well, we, it's his yard time. And mm -hmm. it's all of yard. And people in yard time are usually in prison, and all they think about is this game. <laughs> William! One of the dolls.
little scratched up down there. One of these panels. Hi, Mama. Come here, William. Come here, William. Peanut. Hi, Peanut. Here's our smallest chihuahua, the one that has no adult teeth. Like I said, keep in mind his bark is great, but his biting is, he doesn't have anything to bite with. Look, there's a playmate for you, William. He managed to pull that blanket out I know. from underneath there. I know he did. He's trying to find, dig his way out whole like a prisoner. No, he's happy. Hi, Peanut. William. Uh, William, we'll have to talk to the lawyer about getting you <laughs> early parole. Come here, William. People want to see you. All right, everyone, I think, oh, here we go. I say if he comes out. But um, I think we're going to stop the video here because he's he's more interested right now. I don't think he's noticed Peanut in here. William. William. Hi, Peanut. Look at you looking all cute. Look at you looking all cute, Peanut. And I know it. I know it. Yeah, you cutie pie. He's a cute boy. He's a cute boy. Peanut's going to be eight. Okay, everyone. William, since he's over there, hanging out over there, we're going to leave him alone, let him eat, do what he wants. But we did get a chance to... Um, Take a video with Emma in here. Bella was in here. Uh, oh. he's, he's recognized that there was another. Hi, William. Yeah, the peanuts here. Peanuts in the house. All right, everyone. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed um, seeing William interacting with some of the other animals. I'm seeing Peanut, Mr. Handsome Boy. And uh, we will see you tomorrow. <laughs> Look at him, he's having a ball. We take videos of William every day so you guys can see him, what he does, how he grows up. He is, again, a dwarf lion head rabbit. He's seven weeks old. Okay, hey everyone, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye, everyone. Bye, William lovers. If you have enjoyed this video, click the subscribe button to get the latest contacts. And check out the other great clips on Let's Talk with Melissa and Paul on the YouTube network. Thank you.